need you to get something for me. Go on. I'm tracking five obscura paintings for a client called Eckhart, but he's a psychopath. Why should I care? Because I'm being stalked. People are dying out there. Handle it, Werner. Lara, please. Look, go and see this woman, Carvier. She can help. I'm going. Egypt, Werner. You walked away and left me. Get out! So, hello guys, welcome back now to the game. So, one of the things that I was thinking due to the cutscene is that I forgot to say that this game was really greatly cut. It. So, to release the game on time, as far as I read on the internet, uh, they had cut a lot of stuff from the game. They say that there were uh, weapons and uh, really stuff like behind the door, there was a full environment, but that wasn't ready to, to be released to the consumer, and they kind of just. Um, they kind of just removed it from the final version or add a barrier so that you couldn't go there because it wasn't ready. So probably if they had a little bit more time, the game was a little bit more polished. So yeah, there you go. I was trying just a little bit the, the, the controls because like I told you, I've been trying to play with uh, the, keyboard, the, the gamepad and it is a little bit complicated. So I'm trying to find the key to roll. So it's in here. It's not a great key in there. But okay, let's go. But yeah, it's much more easier with the keyboard, in fact. Possibly many people will disagree with me, but I really feel it to be much more easier on the keyboard. Okay, let's jump. Okay, not good. Yes, I feel so much more natural with the keyboard. You should have seen the videos that I didn't release when I was playing with the gamepad. It was simply horrible. Let me tell you. Okay, it's closed. Oops. Oops. Good stuff. Uh, let's go. Let's explore a little bit, see if we have anything open in here. So there is a door, but nothing is in here. This is the main street. Nothing is there. Up to the window. I'll have a look around 
house trying to raise the sound on the windows. Sorry, I'm just going to raise a little bit on my headphones. So one of the things about this game is that it uh, continues to, um, to deliver a little bit more than the Chronicles. So on the Chronicles you already could kind of um, explore, for example, some of the draws, cupboards and stuff like that. So you can do the same thing in Tomb Raider Angel of Darkness. In fact, there are some new things, like for example, we have money. By now we have 160 euros. Oh, that's good. So I guess I need something to open that. But I don't have it, so probably need a crowbar, Gordon Freeman style. Oh, and by the way, I think, in my opinion, that this Lara Croft is really sexy. Especially with these boobs that are now much better done. So it's really good. This 2003 style. Jeans and stuff like that, it's awesome. So let's go. There are even more coins. Okay, even so the control system is not perfect yet, but should we? It is much more acceptable. Now press up cursor and jump together. Then walk up to the railings, stop and press the up cursor key. Okay, let's go. So one of the things that were added in this game is that Lara Croft is not that strong. And you see she loses their strengths. You have that yellow bar that limits the time that you can be holding to something. Which is very interesting. I, I like it. Uh oh. I can drop. And you don't need to be pressing like control or the action key to continue grabs. So this is really good. It helps you a lot, the fingers at least. So there is some medical stuff in here. Why I can't have... Okay. One of the things that I miss in this game, and I, I don't know if it is possible to use or not, but it is the side walking. Oh, yeah, I can use it. Strange, I, I couldn't use that on the gamepad. So I think I need to go fetch a crowbar, but I, I don't remember what it was, I think it is down in here. Okay. She's not strong enough yet, so you can simply open this door and get the gun and she feels stronger, but I'm going to get back because we left something behind. In case you didn't remember, let's go. I'm still thinking how I'm going to separate the videos because some of the levels are very small and there is also um, a type of small open world that this game has. So I'm not really sure how I can separate this uh, on YouTube. But I don't know. I, I need to think about that first, or I mean later. Let's try to drop safely. It's still very high. Okay. Ooh. Nope, don't turn, please. Okay, let's make the jump. Good. And what is the window? Probably it was down there. Oops. Oh, it was faster. <laughs> okay, let's go.
so what we got in here is a valuable necklace so we could possibly sell this later yes because that is that possibility in this game so let's go up and let's go back let's make the jump I'm going to auto save just in case okay good stuff it's gone well possibly I can make the uh, no I can't let's go back there Fine. So we are back in here again. Let's open this. And yeah, that is a cupboard where we get a pistol, I guess, if I remember properly. Yep. So this is probably one of the main problems of the game. How the hell can I select a weapon? Do I need to go in here? Oh yeah, I need. So let's see. Oh, oh, oh. There we go. So space key is like always the key to, to the weapon. Drop Vara. Okay, so you should be careful with this sequence. Let me just see one thing. I mean, I've been building, saving, but okay, it creates a new save. No, it doesn't. Doesn't create a new save. It makes quick saves. Okay. So let's go. I just wanted to see. Okay. Okay. We made it. I need to move quietly. Press the stealth key and then use the cursor keys to move. Uh I have no idea what is the stealth key, so I need to go see it. Uh stealth. Enter. Which enter? This one? Ah, it is. To hug the wall whilst moving in stealth. The guy is there. Nope. There we go. I think. Not really sure if something is there. I'm not sure if I want to try out and see if something is there. So I'm going to just avoid this. But I want to check it out. I really want to see if something is there. So I'm going to perform a quick save. No. Nothing in here. We can go. I think it's enough. And let's go. Drop the stairs. The level is going to finish now, so a new cutscene will appear. So thank you a lot for seeing the start of a new series. Hope you did enjoy it, and I do hope to see you soon. Goodbye.